Hi everyone, welcome back to Carob Spice. Uh, here is a little cardio demonstration for you. I hopped on the treadmill for some cardio and what you want to do when you get on there is to press the speed interval button, enter all of your information, and um, you want to do that as opposed to manual settings because what I see people doing sometimes makes me cringe. They hop on and off the treadmill you don't have to do that once you set your interval so go ahead and set your weight um, punch in your incline I like starting at about 3.0 miles per hour um, for my jog speed I like to set um, the numbers to 2.0 and for my run, run speed I like starting off with 3.8 miles per hour and what I do as I you know, if I'm doing hit cardio, for example, I um, increase the speed every time. Okay, so this was not necessarily a hit cardio session. I'm actually nursing a slightly hurt knee. There, I'm showing you. That's where you want to put your very light weights. In this video, I was using just five pounds. You don't need a lot of weights. Uh, this is not a weightlifting session. You just want to have something to add a little bit of resistance just to challenge and spice up your regular treadmill routine so all you gotta do is keep um, pressing the speed interval in between a toggle between both so when you press the speed interval button the treadmill speeds up when you press it one more time uh, it slows down okay so press it one more time it slows down um, if you are just really tired and you need a break, you can go ahead and press pause or enter to resume. And if you want to stop, you can press clear or cool down if you want to stop progressively. So, just going to get familiar with the treadmill or the machines at your gym. Now, I'm going to apologize for the angle of recording here. I really do not like recording like this. I like my videos to take the entire screen. But when you're alone um, and your phone just would not stay and you really do not have a lot of time, um, you just got to make things work. But you will get the idea of this video. So basically what I do lately is get on the treadmill, put some very light weights in the bottle holders or the cup holders and start off very slowly with, you know, just like a, a little walk with the weights in my hand. And that is just like my warm up, and I do that for a couple of minutes. You know, I try to make my, um, well, I try to connect my my mind to my body and really think about what I want to accomplish in each session. Okay. Um, then I'm gonna speed up the machine just a little bit so that I'm brisk walking. You want to get to the point where you're getting a workout your heart rate is up but you can actually have a conversation with the person next to you if you have company with you um this is one thing you can actually do with the weights you know it's not a weight lifting session and you really have to think about what you're doing because if you don't you you can actually possibly slide off the treadmill if you're not really um, in tune with what you're doing so i do this uh, for about five minutes on and off fast slow intervals um, keep working my arms my shoulders um, it's just a, another way to spice up your cardio uh, if you love weightlifting like I do you know cardio is like pulling teeth it's not my favorite thing thing to do but um, now that I'm cutting I do have to burn off some extra calories so that is why cardio is so important but it does not replace the weightlifting weightlifting actually results in burning more calories at rest so do not be afraid to lift even when you're on a cut but that's it i hope you enjoyed the video leave me a comment this was just a demonstration of something you can add to your regular treadmill routine thank you guys and i will see you in the next vid bye bye